I'm back with another hunt video, man. You already know what time I'm on. We're gonna be looking for SH figure arts, dragon stars, pretty much everything, man. If you're new to the channel, make sure you subscribe. If you enjoyed the video, make sure you leave a like. Let's get into it. All right, man. As y'all can see, the very first place we did pull up to was Ross. Now, Ross ain't had too much in here. They had a decent amount of anime stuff, but wasn't really that much Dragon Ball stuff. I think the only thing we did find that was Dragon Ball in here was a couple of them Dragon Ball Flash figures, as well as a Limit Breaker series Broly. And we did find a Zamasu 2 pack as well. But other than that, man, like I said, just a bunch of different random anime stuff. As well as some random DC McFarlane figures in here, man. There wasn't really too much in here, which I ain't gonna lie. That's really how Ross been lately. I ain't really been finding nothing in any type of Ross I do go to. I usually find a couple Dragon Stars, but it's been a minute since I've seen some of those in there. Hey, yeah, man. Hopefully, we got better luck in the next store we go to. y'all can see we did just pull up the target we finna go in here and see what they got all right man pulling up to the toy section first like i always say man i ain't gonna waste no time on the marvel legends because there's literally nothing over there Ooh. coming over here to the dc stuff it does look like they're gonna have the same exact stuff we've been seeing at every target which is bogus because it's been a little minute since i did a hunt but they still do got this joker two pack and a bunch of this batman stuff still chilling up here got the hush batman it's pretty much like i said the same exact dc stuff that's been on the shelves coming down here to the transformers i'm not gonna lie same thing with this it all it's gonna be the same as that transformers one stuff that we've been seeing i'm really not finna waste any time with this we finna go to the figure works all right man we is about to slot into the collector section hopefully we got something new stocked over here let me see what end up bruh it's been how long since i did a hunt and i don't see nothing over here bruh they don't have nothing but that naruto over there bruh they don't got nothing here i do not know what's going on with this target but they have not been stocked <laughs> Don't even try it. They have not been stocking nothing for a minute, man. Literally, it's been about what three weeks, and I have not seen nothing new stocked at this Target. Yet. Man, exclusive Vegeta sitting up there, but other than that, man, I ain't even gonna lie. There really isn't any Dragon Ball over here. They do got this Limit Breaker Series Gohan chilling out here, but they also do got that lame Limit Breaker Series 2-pack right there, but like I said, man, other than that, not really too much Dragon Ball going on. They do got a bunch of NECA stuff down here if y'all do want to see that. Definitely a decent amount of NECA stuff over here. The rest of the stuff just gonna be a bunch of random anime stuff, a bunch of random McFarlane, just random stuff scattered throughout. Hey, yeah, man, it's definitely unfortunate. Hopefully, we find some newly stocked at Walmart. We finna find out. All right, man, the next place we pulled up to is Best Buy. We finna go here and see what they got. All right, man, is we gonna have any figure wars? Let's see what we got. I'm already seeing none, bro. <sighs> they be having everything but Dragon Ball, man. Don't make no sense. They still got this in stock, so. Lame Gamma. We got a bunch of other anime stuff that's new as well. as some Dragon Ball statues right here, but <sighs> no figures, man. So, yeah, man, if you're looking for this, make sure you just check your best spot. We finna pull up. All right, man, we did just pull up to Walmart. We finna go in here and see what they got. Oh my God. Bro. Ain't no way. Bruh, that is crazy. I was not expecting to run into this, bruh. Look at all these Super Saiyan God Goku. As y'all can see, they fully stocked these jumps at Walmart. Make sure you is check your Walmart. I literally can't even process what I just ran into. Ooh. Like, I was not expecting this at all. They do have a Super Saiyan Vegeta still cool in here, as well as a Trunks. But yeah, man, like I said, I really can't even wrap my head around this. I do want to go over to the figure art section, because this is just a little collector's area. They are currently over there stocking a bunch of new stuff in the anime section. That's why I'm talking really low because they literally right behind me in the top. But I'm gonna try to sneak over there. We do got some Demon Slayer right here and a bunch of random stuff cooling over here. But we ain't even worried about that. This is crazy, man. I was for sure not expecting this, bro. Make sure you are checking your Walmarts if you're looking for that Super Saiyan God Goku. Because as y'all see, fully stocked. That is crazy. We finna pull up. Hey, man, coming into the toy section now, as far as Star Wars, I'm really not gonna waste no time on it because it is still a bunch of Mandalorian stuff and the Acolyte series stuff. Nothing really changed. So we're gonna go ahead and go down to the DC stuff. 
It's gonna be the same thing with the DC stuff. It's still this Dick Grayson Batman as well as the Adam West Batman. And yet nothing really changed with that either. So like I said, we finna keep it pushing. Coming into the little small Dragon Ball section, we do have a Limit Breaker series, Super Saiyan Blue Gogeta. We do got a base form Goku, another base form Goku chilling back there. As well as a Super Saiyan Vegeta and Super Saiyan Blue Vegeta right there in the Limit Breaker series as well. We have a couple of those Walmart exclusive Super Saiyan Vegetas right here, which I ain't seen these in a minute. So they definitely just stopped those. We do have another base form Goku as well as a Jiren chilling back there. Coming down to the Transformers stuff, I'm not gonna lie, it is gonna be the same Transformers 1 stuff and the Transformers Reactivate stuff we've been seeing everywhere else. So again, I'm not really gonna waste too much time with it. Make sure if you are looking for any of this stuff, you is check out Walmart. We finna pull up. All right, man, we pulled up to the comic book store. We finna go in here and see what they got. Here we are in the comic book store, man. Now, I'm not gonna lie, they definitely be having a decent amount of stuff here. The only problem I have with this store is the prices are outrageous. Everything be overpriced. The only thing I don't think is overpriced in there is that we that i seen in there that's an exclusive i might actually end up picking that up very soon but the rest of the stuff just be crazy like they be charging 27 upwards 30 for some dragon stars and i'm just i'm not doing that bro man we did just pull up to probably the last location of the day we is at another walmart we finna go here and see what they got coming into the anime section at this walmart now this walmart usually be dokey when it comes to figure wars which is starting to make me want to avoid this walmart altogether but i still do be trying to slide by here to see if they finally do got something new in but as y'all can see they ain't have nothing but some dragon stars and them random anime figures like the chainsaw man and the figure from my hero academia yeah, yeah i'm just honestly not surprised because this store is just garbage all together even in the toy section they be lame they barely be having none the transformers was pretty much the same as it usually is they didn't have anything else in stock but they did actually have a shadow in stock which actually surprised me like i said today's hunt is just the weirdest hunt I've ever been on all right, man, as y'all can see, we are back at the crib, man. I ain't even gonna lie. Today, we ain't really see too much out there as far as figure wars today. Today was definitely probably the weirdest figure hunt I've ever did for the simple fact that we didn't see anything at Target. We ain't seen nothing in Best Buy and nothing nowhere else, but we did end up running into a bunch of Super Saiyan God Gokus at Walmart, which one, Walmart never stocked nothing, and two, I definitely wasn't expecting to see Super Saiyan God Goku at Walmart, let alone right now. That definitely caught me off guard, and that's why I'm saying it's one of the weirdest figure hunts I've ever did because tell me how Target ain't gonna handle figure wars, but Walmart did. That is definitely one of the weirdest things I've seen in a minute. Now, I did end up picking something up off screen. Y'all just didn't see it. Now, what I did end up getting was yet another Super Saiyan Blood Awakening Vegeta. The reason I did pick another one up is because I will be actually turning this into a base form Vegeta because like I said in my recent videos, I have been heavy into customizing these figures lately, but that isn't the only thing I did get because I did actually have a couple things come in the mail today. I did get not one, but two bootleg Gogetas in the mail today, and I I will be reviewing both of these soon because apparently both of these are new bootleg Gogetas compared to the previous one that they did used to sell. But yeah, man, not only did I get those, but I also got this gigantic 2007 Transformers Megatron right here. Now this thing is just way too big to even fit in the camera, but I'm gonna try to give y'all the best look at it. Like I said, this is from the 2007 Transformers movie. Not only did I get this, but I did also have an Optimus Prime that I ordered at the same time that I was supposed to have come in with this. But instead of getting the Optimus Prime, when I did open the box, this is what I ended up seeing as y'all can see from the side of the box that is clearly hot rod i'm still mad as hell that they sent me the wrong figure even though the figure itself is a solid figure it just isn't what i ordered so i definitely will be getting a refund for that but yeah man definitely got a decent amount of stuff in today if you're new make sure you subscribe if you're joining me make sure you leave a like to the amount stay tuned